Well, you just never know when the next UFC superstar is going to emerge. I submit to you, the UFC's interim middleweight champion, Israel Adesanya, only made his UFC debut in February of 2018, and it's an understatement to say he has taken this sport by storm. It's an understatement, a massive understatement. For a long time, I had heard about Israel Adesanya before he even got to the UFC, but did not know what to expect. I did not expect such a versatile skill set, an ability to stay upright, yeah. an ability to deal with the pressure of wrestlers, an ability to stay the course whenever things aren't going necessarily as you planned. He was just wise beyond his time in the octagon from the moment he got there. And I think that's because he chose the exact right time yes. to come to the UFC. Right, he didn't force it. He has become a sensation overnight. And most people believe when it comes to Israel Adesanya, the best is yet to come. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing. And it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 22 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 200 pounds. Israel, the last style bender, Adesanya! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your point. First round is underway here. We say in mixed martial arts, it's one thing to have the reach advantage, it's another thing to use it. We'll see if he can get that jab going to He him. has got to fight tall. He's got to stay at range, use his length to give his opponent problems, trying to bring the fight into a closer distance. Caught with that punch. 
man, look at Adesanya putting his words into action. I don't want him hope. I aim and fire. The accuracy is just on a completely different level, and not surprising that he has drawn comparisons to the consensus greatest middleweight champion in UFC history, the great Anderson the Spider Soap. Oh, man, this is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head in MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy should play up there so fast. Sometimes you don't see it coming. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, just truly mixing up the target. Sight to behold. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Over three minutes now to go in round one. Nice. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Good straight hand there by Lee. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Israel Adesanya. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. He is all about that left kick to the body. Checks the leg kick. Ooh. And now he lands a combination. Just misses with the left hook. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? And both guys really throwing with authority. Beautiful land there by Adesanya. You hear this crowd just eating out of his hand, oohing and on every time he advances. I mean, he just captures your imagination from the walkout to the entrance when he's in the octagon, the fighting style. He just kind of has that thing that makes you want to stop and stare at Israel Adesanya. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Big kick lands. Seconds now to go in the round. Ooh, found a home for that knee. Thank you. Punch coming, it's blocked. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Well, he's the taller fighter and will land a knee to the body with relative ease there. Unable to connect with the right. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. John, it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Big head kick land. All right, single collar tie now. All right, Muay Thai clinch. A lot of elbows and knees could be coming from here. We'll see how he chooses to attack. Yeah, it's a very dangerous position, but an advantageous one for the offensive fighter. Watch for the defensive guy to try to break this immediately. Man, he keeps on coming with these shots to the liver, looking to buckle him once again. Certainly buckled him earlier in the fight. He knows he's hurt there. Oftentimes, it takes just one to get his opponent down to the canvas. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC. And if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him. That was so impressive to see. Someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Okay, let's focus. Let's focus now. Oh, and he lands.
lands another knee there, DC. He talked a lot to us about his length and his size advantage. Doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it certainly did. Liver kick. Pretty good job staying patient as he lands the counter strike there. Strong work by Lee. Adesanya gets the tie clinch here. Nice body kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Just out of range with that right hook. Big kick land. Adesanya's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Unable to connect with the right hand there. strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Nice kick there by Lee. Another shot lands upstairs. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes him stop throwing. Lee gets caught with that punch, and they separate. Just misses with the jab there. He's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Oh, collar tie. Nice punch there. Try to establish that jab. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Goes right back to that left kick and lands. Got to whip his hip into that kick. Oh, big head kick lands. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Israel Adesanya's kick loss. Oh, that right hand is on point. High-level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Lee. Big call from punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Oh, big punch lands. Oh, Superman punch is good. Spinning back fist. Just misses with the jab. Oh, nice jab by him there, and I guess on the other side, hard to get your offense going when your head keeps getting snapped back like a Pez dispenser. Every time he tries to go forward and use his own offense, the jab is stopping him in his tracks. He's doing a great job of fighting behind him. Nice kick. Let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there and he's not on his toes and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. Settle down. Listen, he's landing way too many body shots. Right? Way too many. You're way too good. 
All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going. He doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Great punch landed with so much power. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Just out of range with that right hand. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Overhand counter by Lee. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, he lands a huge kick here. Massive head kick. There it is. Take the shot. Adesanya gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Head kick. Nice one, two there. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Adesanya gets stung by that leg kick. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. He's back in the push position. This is where he has done a ton of good work here. Punch, punch, punch to the head. From the clip. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Nice kick there by Adesanya. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. with a kick now. Let's see if he can route. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Oh, what a punch. Just misses there with the left. Throws a straight punch and lands, so that is increasingly becoming an effective weapon for him tonight. This is one of his best strikes, and he's throwing it over and over again. Well, you got to think he's going to enjoy watching this one back tomorrow morning. He has landed a ton of significant strikes, and really a guy who has been a monster in the gym finally putting it together here in the office. To go home and admire your work, it doesn't take till the next morning. He's going back to the room <laughs> right now and firing up the video to look at beauty in action, and he was the one causing all the action. Israel Adesanya gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Bone on bone as the head kick lands flush. He better get those hands up or he's gonna put him to sleep. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offer it there. And they separate. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch landing. Adesanya's lower jaw, very swollen. Oh, that's a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, an educated jab there. I could watch this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, it comes right back to his face. Israel Adesanya going with the kick to the body. He's an outstanding kicker, but that attempt missed. Real sneaky body kick. 20 seconds left. Good. All right. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single follow tie. 10 seconds. Nice leg kick. 
kick. Strong straight left there. All right, so in entertaining five minutes, let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, all right, calm down, calm down. You've been hit with bigger shots than that, all right? You're gonna shake this off, you're gonna come back and you're gonna... All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Big punch land from the middle. Way to hide that leg kick. Oh, nice straight punch there by Lee. Just missing on the high kick there. That one certainly found the target. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Oh, and he caught the kick. Leg kick. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Good punch, Lance. Nice, sneaky head kick. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Outstanding kick there by Lee. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Oh, nice straight punch there. Must be nice to have a reach advantage like this, DC. All right, so a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony. Always seeing things coming at him. He's such a great defensive fighter. Right hand upstairs. Nice punch by Lee. This guy cannot miss the head with his strikes. Right up the elbow. Body keep playing. Nice jab by him there. He's going nose hunting tonight, huh? Yeah, he's great with the jab. And not only as a setup, really is trying to get damage off every time he throws this punch. Well, at this point, the fight is way up on the judges' scorecards, and from a stamina standpoint, he looks like he can fight all night. He does a fantastic job of fighting at a great pace, but also knowing exactly where to preserve it, well, to conserve the energy, and it's showing when you look at his gas tank, and it seems as though it's still full. Look at him drive his shin into the whole body with that body kick. Didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kicks would be the key tonight, and they sure have been. Ooh, what a punch. Checks the leg kick. Oh! Oh! See, you don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Be able to land there with the straight left. Gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Oh, nice job by the longer, taller fighter to land a flush knee to the head. Adesanya gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Just missed with the left there. Sneaky head kick. Nice straight punch. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Forty-five seconds remain in the round. Well 
place kick there by Lee. Liver kick. Just misses with the straight right. Oh, nice. Just out of range with that kick attempt. Oh, man, that leg's all beat up. Nice head kick. Well, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. This is it. Your striking is what got you here. And your striking is what's going to get us out of here, all right? All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kicks, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Nice knee to the body there by Adesanya. Ooh, big shot land. Beautiful leg kick throw. Right hook attempt. That's a little picture perfect body shot there. He's hurt. Unbelievable. That shot lands it perfectly. And now he's got his opponent hurt. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Well place kick there by Lee. Back and forth we go. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land anywhere. Oh, man, head kick lands. Please kick his block. Slip that offering from his opponent. In the past, we've seen him sort of lean on the toughness. Tonight, he's leaning on the defense. And you see the elements of the fighter in front of us. He doesn't have to be tough anymore. The more he can slip strike, the longer he can prolong his career. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, here's a kick to the body. Blocked, though, by Adesanya. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Big body kick. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Three minutes now to go in this one. That jab snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast, and he always brings his hands right back to his face. Body kick now by Lee. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Israel Adesanya gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Oh, nice. Good stick. Right there, his opponent's compromised, DC. It's one thing to land a hard shot. It's another thing completely to land a perfect shot. And that was a perfect shot. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. What a head kick. All right, well, time is now. Oh! He's out. Oh! <laughs> yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. All right, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight, but 
Don't ignore all the work he did with his hands and give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way. And in order to get a fight of the night like you got tonight, both guys have to be willing to participate. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine is going to stop for this contest at three minutes, 15 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, so there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything he needed to do to find the knockout. Now he can celebrate with his family and friends as they earn this spectacular victory.